so we're at McDermott Park today for some Johnson vs Motherwell before Eurovision tonight of course. Um, so hopefully we'll be in disco fever by full time. Uh, prediction, we're due a win here. It's been five attempts since the last time we won here. Uh, so we'll go a 2-1 win for the world. but it was offside. <laughs> I mean, I knew it was off as soon as the ball was played, but VAR is being checked here. I mean, it was Sons that deliberately played the ball, but I think it deflected off the St. John's player. I don't think that's going to matter, though. I think it was offside. Yeah, offside given. I mean, I know what the rules are, but it would have been a lot simpler if the linesman had just given the offside when he was offside. Half time so far, I think it's it's felt like an end of season game, not gonna lie. St. Joseph sat in most of the ball, most of the chances. Van Veen scored that goal that was offside. I mean, I have no complaints, it was definitely offside. I'd like to see us go and get a goal in the second half, but it, it just feels like St. St. Joseph have wanted this game more and they've sat in most of the ball and it's. I don't know. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm, I'm not as stressed as I usually would be watching this sort of game, but I, I just want a wee bit more from the players. But yeah, half time, no, no. Bring on the second half. Second half, about to kick off. On the way. Yeah. 
think. Yeah, there was encroachment, so it's got to be retaken.
So all in all, a fantastic result for Motherwell and, you know, in the first half I thought St Johnson edged it and they were slightly the better team. Uh, however, we dealt with what we had to deal with very well and I think in the second half there was no no questions about it. I thought uh, we definitely took the game by the scruff of the neck and got the penalty early on. We missed it, but goalkeeper was off his line and uh, there was four St Johnson defenders encroaching. Uh, so that was more than enough for the referee to have to pull the play back, give us another penalty and Kevin Van Veen penenkered it down the middle of the goal and that sent us on our way to three points. And it was also great to see Mikhail Mandron get on the score sheet as well. It's the first time since Arbroath on his debut in January. So, yeah, fantastic result all in all. Um, I don't have much analysis to give uh, other than the fact that I thought we were pooing the first half, but the second half we turned up and that's all that mattered. And uh, we are now one point ahead of Livingston and sitting in seventh. And that's the highest we've been in the league for as long as I can remember. So, yeah, brilliant result. And uh, bring on Ross County next week. And I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Later on uh, in the week, uh, before before Saturday, I will be uploading another video, uh, which is very close to my heart. So I'm hoping that does well. But, yes, uh, I'll, I'll keep you in tune. And I'll see you guys later. Take care.